What's up y'all, it's your girl T and I am here to introduce to you guys one of the latest and greatest wig business essentials that is out now, which is our ultimate wig business planner, all right? This right here is my baby, okay? This is something that I've been working on for over six months now and this planner has everything you need in one for your wig business so you know this planner came about because you know i was once the business that was all over the place had sticky notes felt like you know i don't know what i need to be doing when i need to be doing it um it's just overwhelming it's so much information it's so much out there i don't know where to start um, I was also one of the ones that bought different types of planners. Some planners had more than enough information pages that I didn't need in them. Just a lot of information that um, was not useful to me as a wig business. There was also some planners that was good, but they didn't have enough. So I decided to come out with a planner that is specific for us wig business owners. So I already know that, you know, we have a lot of hats that we have to wear. We're customer service. We have to make sure these wigs are taken care of. We have to do content. We have to do a lot. And in order for our business to run successfully, we need to make sure that we are planning out our business. We need to be planning out our goals, planning out um, the things, our to-do list, our content, um, keeping up with our insights, and just so much more. So what better place to have everything than to have it all wrapped up in a wig business planner so this planner is specifically for you and i and it is the best tool that you will need in the year 2022 so let's just talk about some of the things that are inside of this planner i packed this planner with everything that i felt that was missing or that i needed for my business so I know that this stuff will be beneficial for you guys and your business. So in this planner, oh y'all, I'm giving you everything, okay? So I have, um, of course, I always want to start off with your purpose, your reason, you know, behind why. Why are you starting this business? You know, what for those slow days, those days that, you know, you may feel like giving up, you want to always remember your why. And so we have a page here where you can write down your why, your purpose, your reason for this entire business. All right. So we have your why. Um, I have a business overview for the different products, courses or services that you offer offer um i also have a target audience worksheet we all know that your target audience if you don't know who they are then you're probably not making the sales that you can potentially be making knowing your target audience is the foundation for your business so you know i could not forget to put a target audience worksheet inside of this planner I included your annual overview where you break down all four quarters of the year so that if you have specific things that you're working on, you already have an outlook of the entire year in your annual um, review. I have inventory checklist or inventory uh, sheets in here. So for those of you that have certain products, need place to keep your inventory, it's all in one, baby. I'm giving you everything in one. Um, your hashtag tracker, go ahead and generate certain hashtags, have them uh, written down so that you know those hashtags that are working, the ones that aren't, get rid of them, but we have a hashtag planner. I have a um, business roadmap in here, so if you're a new business and you're not sure where to start or what's some of the first things that you need to do to get started, I got you, all right? So I have a roadmap that's telling you the first steps you need to do to get make sure that your business is headed in the right direction. And if you already have an established business, then going through this roadmap will just let you know that you are going in the right direction. So I give you that. I even have a 30-day content idea um, calendar in here. So if you are stuck on what kind of content, what should I be putting out, what type of reels, videos, posts, I give you 30 days worth of content ideas specific to wig businesses. You can remix these ideas, you can repurpose these ideas, and you can use these ideas for up to six months, especially if you have multiple products. So I'm giving you content up in here. 
Um, I also have monthly business affirmations. So I'm extremely big on affirmations, manifesting, believing, writing things down, um, speaking things into existence. And to have these monthly affirmations is just going to be that push or that reminder that you are doing what you're supposed to be doing. You're in your purpose and you're headed in the right direction. Don't give up. So I have different monthly affirmations. I have a place for you to put your content ideas. Guys, I have, um, of course, your calendar where you can plug in everything for the full month in here. I have your weekly content plan. So for those of you that want to post three times a day, um, which is, you know, kind of ideal posting your three times a day, you can go ahead, sit down on Sunday and write out your week worth of three posts that you're going to post every day. Write those ideas down. Even if you don't have them done yet, write them down, repurpose that content, um, and check them off. So you got a place to put check whether you used that content or did exactly what you said on Monday, those three uh, content uh, ideas. Check that stuff off, but I have a place in here for that. I even have a place for you to keep up with your insights um, monthly for your budget. If you have a monthly budget and for your sales goals. Um, I have a goal plan if you have specific goals that you need to work on. I have a, a plan where you can put your strategies and your action steps. I have a weekly planner in here, to-do list. I have notes. I'm telling you, it's all wrapped up in one. Like, you won't need anything else to keep your business organized and together aside from this wig business ultimate, um, this ultimate wig business planner. So you may be wondering why, why do I need this wig business planner, T? Um, you know, is this wig business planner for me? Do I need this? Listen, if you have a wig business and you feel that your business is struggling, if you feel that your business is all over the place, um, you don't know, you know, there's so much information out there. You don't know what you need to be doing first, second, third, you have an idea. It comes to mind. Um, you go back to it or you forget to go back to it. Hey, this planner is going to keep you in check. All right. I'll be using this planner all throughout the year. I'll be referencing this planner and I hope that you can be able to follow along and have this planner as well so that we can start making sure we plan it out and we are checking off things for the year so that our business is continuously growing. So this is the answer here. If you got a problem. This is all you need right here. So I hope that you go out and you grab your planner, um, get them now while, you know, it's early so that you can utilize this full year. Um, and I know if this has helped me, because again, I've already started using this. I've been using this since my sample came. So, um, this, this work, this is my secret. If you want to know how T, how are you getting everything done? How are you so organized? Um, you know, with life and with your business, listen here's my secret. I keep everything written down and planned out in my ultimate week business planner. And that's just the truth. Like I'm, I'm very old school. So I like to keep everything written down before this was a lot of sticky notes and stuff. Now I don't need sticky notes. Now it's, Hey, where's my week business planner? Take this with you wherever you go. You got your business right here in your hand. So invest, invest in this small investment can turn your entire business around. If you feel like last year or previous years or, you know, you're just not doing what you thought you would be doing, your business is just not growing like you thought it would be, hey, it's time to change some things. If something's not working, it's time to change it. And with changing it, that may require you to make some investments. And some investments could simply be something such as small as it may seem, but as a planner or something that's going to help you stay more organized and, um, you know, goal oriented so that you can stay on track. So go and check out this week business planner. It is available right now. Click the link below.